Hey guys, Traps and Trap Tape Plays here, and today I wanted to take a look back at some old Final Fantasy Versus 13 content. Uh, maybe reminisce about what we could have gotten. Uh, I should preface by saying that Final Fantasy 15 Royal Edition is really good, but when 15 initially came out, I was really disappointed. But now we got the Royal Edition, it's really good. So <clears throat> let's let's look back at what we could have got. Uh, one more thing: subscribe, like this video if you like it by the end, and uh, share it. Nocti Soji. Nocti Soji. Nocti Soji. Nocti Soji. a fantasy based on reality. Remember that one? Remember that old thing? I think that's, um. Oh gosh, I forgot his name. He's one of the cooler characters. Corin. No. Is it Corin? Oh no, that's Regis. I don't know why Regis is driving. That's weird. I don't know if he was like. He's got the skull and crossbones. Which was cut out for Chinese audiences or some shit? Some BS. Some sort of death cult, like that was a religion or um. I thought it was a cool concept. Looks really good. Being 2011. You're meeting. Destined by the Divine. That looks weird. Oh, there's that classic music. And Stella? I think that's her name. Ha ha ha. That's uh, Eos, I think, is her name. I forget her name. <laughs> Great. Looks like some Yoshitaka Amano art. I can't read Japanese, so. I just know that, like, they look kind of shiny. But that's 2011 for you, I guess. What the hell is that? Oh, right, because it's always nighttime in Insomnia. Right? I think that was a thing. Eyes that see the light of expiring souls. He was supposed to see dead things or something. Oh, there's Regis. Get out of here, we don't want you. I like the way Regis looks in um, Final Fantasy XV. This is the whole royal aesthetic. I think the act of love by the last king. <coughs> I've been sick. Sorry if I cough. And then the city is invaded by the Empire. Which was unfortunately cut from the game. Uh, and put into a movie? See, I was so excited for this concept. And I was incredibly disappointed when I got the game and none of this made it in. I can't, they took essentially everything I was excited for in all the original 13 content, like that all got cut out. Every reason why I was excited. Uh, combat looks basic, but good. Looks more solid. Uh, but not as, quite as flashy, but that's okay. Magic's better. Oh, the armored behemoths look badass. Oh. He's got a samurai sword instead of, uh, daggers.
That sword is crazy. I wish that one wouldn't made it in. Ooh, that was cool. <sighs> I like the tighter corridors and s segregated areas. I wish 15 was less open and more linear. I think it would have made for better storytelling. Looking at this world, though, it does look more fantasy oriented than, than what we got. The world of 15, like the open world part, is amazing. It does look way better than this. More inspired than this, too. I'll give them that. You see that double jump? That. That's cool. Too bad we didn't get anything like that. Did we? We might have got <coughs> Oh man. That would have been dope. Oh, and there's um... Oh. I forgot her name. It's been a while since I played 15. Outfit skimpier, that's for sure. I'm glad they managed to work that into the movie at least. Noctisoma. What are they saying? <laughs> Uh, versus their team. The figure that lies asleep in the fantasy. Whatever the hell that means. Tetsuya, what were you planning for PlayStation 3? <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay. Oopsie daisies. So I said. Nope. Sorry, gamers joint. Well, that was, uh. Looking back at some old versus 13 content. Uh, man, uh, we should do this for that. For the 15 reveal trailer. And I could talk about how disappointed I was in that. <laughs> uh, thanks again for watching, guys. If you like the video, like the video, give me that thumbs up. Ba bam. And, uh, consider subscribing. It would mean a whole lot. It'll motivate me to make more content. Um, Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Peace.